Hello everyone and welcome back to Lewis News, your number one YouTube channel for all types of Spider-Man news. And in today's video, we are covering the first official poster for Spider-Man across the Spider-Verse. Yes, a bunch of stuff is coming out about this movie, so make sure you're subscribed and make sure you have the bell notification on because we're getting a bunch of rumors, we're getting official stuff coming out from Sony Pictures as well. So if you want to stay in the loop and you do not want to miss any of that information, make sure you're subscribed to the channel. We cover everything from the games, the movies, and the shows, and of course, Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse on this channel, so make sure you're subscribed. With that being said, let's get straight into the breakdown of the poster. So this was the poster that was just released, in fact, about 10 minutes ago, and as you can see, it, it's a really nice looking poster we've got miles morales front and center of the poster upside down and what's interesting is is that the spider logo is actually the right way up on the poster i thought that was a funny little detail there and obviously we've got the logo underneath miles's head and they've done a really cool design where all the Spider-Men and women behind Miles Morales on the poster are actually engraved into the city skyline. Because if you look at the cutoff point of where the white background actually meets the Spider-Men and women, the lineup of them, you'll actually notice that it's the New York City skyline, which I think is a neat little detail. And this little style of poster here is very simplistic and very stylistic at the same time. And obviously all these spider people that are to appear in Spider-Man across the Spider-Verse featuring prominently on the the poster as well so here are a few that i have noticed that i think you guys should pay attention to obviously we have miguel o'hara and gwen stacy front and center at the front of the poster but more interestingly front and center we also have spider-man india on the right and ben riley scarlet spider on the left and what makes this really interesting is that we know that miguel o'hara and gwen stacy are going to be main characters in this film but ben riley and spider-man india we haven't really gotten much into terms of the marketing or any news or any kind of leaks suggesting that they will be playing prominent roles in the film and you'd think since this is the official poster for the film that they would feature the characters that are going to have a bigger role at the forefront of the poster like for example we also do have Jessica Drew behind Ben Riley and Miguel O'Hara who we know is going to feature as a prominent character in the film so whether Scarlet Spider and Spider-Man India have some crucial role to play I don't know but I think it's pretty interesting nonetheless. Behind Jessica Drew we also have the amazing Bagman as well. Behind Spider-Gwen we can also see Spider-Punk which interestingly enough if you guys remember back on Lewis Films when I was uploading news videos on there there was a bunch of stuff coming out about Spider-Punk all the merchandise and there was a bunch of toys coming out about Spider-Punk as well so it's interesting to see him finally feature on a piece of marketing because he wasn't prominently featured in the trailer. However another Spider-Person that in fact got a reveal through merchandise was Cyborg Spider-Woman and she actually features prominently on the poster as well behind Spider-Punk in that right hand corner a few others that i've managed to pick out is we've got a few spider armors in there as well one above miguel o'hara and another one on the right as well we can also see another spider armor above cyborg spider woman too we can also see what might possibly be a variant of Jessica Drew in the top hand left as well. But yeah, that is pretty much all of the Spider-Men and women that prominently feature on this poster. All the others are either too blurry in the background or we can't really make out who they are. So I'm just going to leave them for now. But those are all the prominent characters on the poster. Once again, I think it's interesting about Scarlet Spider and Spider-Man India being so prominently at the front. Will they have some kind of major role to play in the film like Miguel and like Jessica Drew? We'll just have to see. But that's pretty much it for the Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse official poster. Do you guys like this poster? Let me know in the comment section down below. Also, make sure to leave a like on this video if you did enjoy. Make sure to subscribe for future Spider-Man news videos. We cover everything on this channel. Like I did say at the start of the video, this is your number one YouTube channel for all types of Spider-Man news. We cover everything from the games, the movies, and the shows. Also, make sure to hit the bell next to the subscribe button so you do not miss any more content as soon as it gets posted. With that being said, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care and peace.